As one of the emperors of soul, former Temptations lead singer Dennis Edwards died here in Chicago last night. Two investigator Brad Edwards broke the story and has more on his life and his passing. I can turn the gray sky blue. The man who crooned the world over, Dennis Edwards, is dead. I can fly like a bird in the sky. He was stricken on Thursday. Responders responded to this bus stop on South Michigan Ave. He was transported to Mercy Hospital, where he died Thursday evening. When you heard the news today, what did you think? It's heartbreaking. It's uh, like the end of, a, to me, the end of a legend. He is the voice of the Temptations. You know, the most recognizable voice. It was like the end of an era, almost. Denise Jordan Walker, his former publicist, on the phone. Name your favorites. Cloud Nine. You can be what you want to be. He also led on the song that made Third of September remarkable. Papa was a rolling stone. He added his mark to Christmas Carol, Silent Night. And I sit around by the fireplace. The Rock and Roll Hall of Famer, seen here with the Queen of Soul, Aretha Franklin, had suffered a stroke and came to Chicago for rehab. He's remembered. He never let them see him sweat. Stay calm and it's going to work out. And that's the biggest lesson I learned from him. Not hard to play cool. When you're so cool. And again, he'd been sick for some time, friends say. Dennis Edwards was 74. He would have been 75 tomorrow. Robin Erica. Wow, what a talented man. And so many yeah. of those songs, generations, will yeah. still remember him for those. A absolutely. My mom will be talking about him all weekend. Yeah, yeah I bet. Yeah. Thanks.